radiant skin. Available at Murad.com, Ulta, Sephora, and Massage Envy Spa. Well, how many times have you heard that the way to a man's heart is through his stomach? Well, with this recipe, that might just be true. Tara Bench, food and entertaining director of Ladies Home Journal, is here to show us how to make a fun and delicious man catcher brownie. And there's a, there's a really good story behind them, yeah? There is. Amy Westerman, a reader from Arkansas, submitted this story, and she swears that it's been... Uh, two proposals have been the result of eating these brownies. You guys have a great segment in Ladies Home Journal, and it's, it's a recipe, but also we get to hear the story behind it. So there's something of a story behind these, and you're going to tell it while I get the caramels yeah, ready? Yeah, so it starts off with, it's a caramel nut brownie. So okay. we're going to start with the caramel. Okay. So let's unwrap, we unwrap about okay. 30 caramels. So put here, yeah. We put them in there, and we've got some already done for you, and then we measure out a third of a cup okay. of evaporated milk. All right. And what is the story behind these? Is this a, a mother-daughter? Is this a, where did these come from? Is this a family so recipe? Amy's mother made them for her boyfriend at the time, who blurted out, I love you, after he tasted these brownies. I think he and meant I love the brownies. And then they got married. <laughs> brownies. So, <laughs> so we melt the caramel and get okay. all delicious. Okay. We have some here, and we let it cool. So while that delicious caramel cools... So we've just made ourselves a nice thick caramel sauce. Exactly. Evaporated milk and caramels. Okay. Easy. So the other secret is it's a cake mix. So it's really simple. Oh, I love that. It's a German chocolate cake mix. So German chocolate. Mix that in a bowl. All right. With oh, good, good catch. I'll take care of that. Perfect. That's my version of cleaning up. Throw it in the sink. Melted butter. And would you butter. mix it? Melted butter. How much butter's in there? It is a third of a cup third or a half cup. a cup. Okay. And a third of a cup more of evaporated milk. I have not used a lot of evaporated milk in my cooking. It's, it's a little sweeter, it's a little thicker, but it's just easy to use okay. in this cake mix. So Amy and her friends used to make these for her boyfriends. Yeah. And there were lots of broken hearts when they <laughs> broke up and the boys didn't get any more brownies. This is looking good. I bet. So use a German chocolate cake mix and make sure that it's the right size box cakes mix because okay. they come in different sizes. And it's kind of a milk chocolatey situation. I can, yeah, no, I can smell that. And you, what you have here is, uh, what is that, a nine inch pan with it's parchment? It's a nine by 13. Nine exactly. by 13. Exactly. Look at you, cooking skills. And we lined it with parchment. And that is a secret that will show you why we do that at the end. Okay. So you can just lift those brownies out. You've so, got it all done. Am I close enough to done yes. here? Mostly mixed in. And that's all. Yes. I thought we'd know more wet ingredients, but that's it. No, that's super easy because the okay. cake mix has it all in it. So we do about a cup and a half of this mix as the base of the brownie. So okay. I'm just eyeballing that, but you can measure it. All right. And set this aside, hang on to it for the topping. Because we will need it. Mm -hmm. And we're going to spread that out. You can use the really? spatula. So you're going to press it I'm down. Gonna you're going to use your hands because you are awesome. Yes. And it becomes this thin layer of batter. Oh. And then we're going to bake that in just a minute. OK. Um, oh, I'm careful messing up with your that parchment. parchment. I know, I know. Right? Cardinal sin, cardinal sin. Okay, so this we need takes to spread a few minutes. This, this is a labor of love. We need to spread this all the way around in a thin layer. Evenly all around. To the edges of the pan, right? But we have some already in but the we oven. We have some already in the oven. So yes. after we do this, we bake them. And bake it for, partially bake it, for about seven minutes. So we're just going to set that base and okay. get that brownie base. So this bakes for about seven minutes, and then we get to the real goodness where we put the toppings and everything else on? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll get there. We're going to take a break. We're going we're gonna to grab one. We have some of this already baked up. We're going to top these brownies and teach you how to turn them into man-catcher brownies right after this. Every Tuesday, The Better Show mixes it up.